can't be level two, having the totem and the aftershock. So the trades are going to favor Monet for the first two levels, but one and two. Only at three is there like something else for Seb where he can like actually totem and stun you. So it's very interesting as to like how much of your uh, your regen you want to commit as OG because this is an IO. Oh. Yeah, I don't know. Monet, will he go down though? All the regen coming from Lanham, it's not going to be enough and has the salve going now. So yeah, um, watch OG several games in a row now, and he does this a lot. He plays this deep ward, and he just goes for the courier kills, and that really, really hurts an IO. Because like the whole point of IO is just buying a bunch of regen and sending it out. Mid lane, Thompson almost brought down White Album there, getting really close, and instead, oh my God, it's just a deny he's there. Just suiciding. Yeah, we're That's good. Fine. Thompson chasing White Album. Looking for that rune. He has another yeah. round of toss, and he got him. There you go. Pull back, though. And White Album gets healed back up by Lana, making the rotation, and now Thompson going to fall. Was it worth it? Oh, but he's getting hit by those little freaking bull assassins. They're the worst. Oh, he's out. He's going to be dead. So if he sentries this blank hill, I'm just going to be depressed for him. Yeah. Won't be good. Seb, again. Go for the nice silence. Him. Lots of damage. Amped up. Chasing down onto Seb. Another round. Dude, White Album playing this so safe. White Album Monet, he's alive on oh, nothing. Brutal. 40 HP. The chase down comes. And that is a 6 and 0 oh start for Aster. Oh, man. Puck players and Storm players. If you get too close to the tower, they are just so hungry. Curves. It means that he's late for gank sometimes, but this is why he gets solo kills sometimes, you know? It's he true. doesn't do, like, the straight beeline. Oh, and, and now he's in a strange spot because of yeah. this. Yeah. Well, that's that's what's funny about this. I mean, they might be able to make something happen. They hit onto Tops and realize he's there. Look at this now guy. get the vision. Look at this toss. guy. Well the, played. The angles, man. That was very well done. He's just way out there on the curve. He, they don't see it coming. It's costly because if he doesn't get that kill, he's not farming during that time. He's in the danger. We'll back out. Thompson. Oh, he stick around a little bit too long. We got White Album in the area too. Moves on in, finds him there, pull back, a couple right clicks, goes through. That dude, he's done. Eventually. Eventually. Wait, mid. Oh. Quick blow up there. Borax got caught. It happens in a second. That's all it takes. I mean, that's a dangerous support, too. Very reminiscent of how uh, LGD were playing before. I feel like... Is this one of those games where the Helm the Overlord comes out and the creep never dies and Aster wins? I think that's what's maybe going to happen here. It feels like one of those games. Tops in. Jumps in. Oh, well, to find next. This is the perfect play if they can get it in time. But the relocate coming in. They find Seb. Tries to blow him up. Oh, but the blow up! Monet ends up falling. Seb takes him down in the relocate. Is he going to come back in time? Lanham gets pulled away. And now Monet, he's a sad bear all alone. Run away, Panda. You got nowhere to go. The avalanche, oh, the toss, man. the control. It was you supposed know? to be so good. You know that cosmetic on the bear with the little one on the back? You know his name's Little Dipper? Oh. You know who the Little Dipper was Almost there? called his mark there with the you're dead, but couldn't quite get it in time. There it is. Granite Golem. He finally found himself a uh, an ancient creep. They kept killing them all. So oh. Nexus has couldn't get one. So now he is equipped. Tumbler setting him in. Jeez. They just me. blow him up there. <laughs> so a good jump from Aster, and with the big creep, and now able to move in and take over the outpost again. Uh, there's definitely some potential here to be some death ball Dota. As White Album takes the DD, backs away, oh, but there you go. they catch, they kill. And you know what happens when you get Sumail Storm Spirit? It gets dangerous. Even when it's in Morphling version. <laughs> On a burst damage, you can catch someone after the initial burst, and like, you know, halfway through the big combos between the Tiny and the, uh, the Sky, that, that's completely uh, fight and game winning. Oh, I don't know if that was a visual bug or not, or if they saw what was going on. But the jump to Thompson's not going to connect. Now looking for Seb. Now looking for No Tail. Now looking for a, a way out, and he is gone. White Album overextending, but now the turn they take down Seb. And Lanham living on absolutely nothing. You know, that pipe, that pipe keeping him alive. XXS trying to back away. Avatars yet again. Wait for him through. In some the trouble. Silence, and they got him caught for the kill. And well, the bugs going to be enough for the right click down. Hotel appreciating what Sumail is doing here in this game. I mean, they're going to send in the Hawk. They're going to see this. White Album is on the other side of the map and Seb. still not showing up. 
That was a little crazy. Yeah. <laughs> He's teasing them. So, toss back. Success and some trouble. Now the turn onto Thompson. Trying to jump, trying to go for the kill, but it's not enough. Well, now White Album jumps in, trying to control, seeing if they can kill him off. They have the fireball down, everything for Sep, and he will eventually fall. And now, Monet, he kills Sumail. They made some mistakes. Dead for 60 seconds, no buyback. He, uh, he got organed. That zip through was perfectly timed by White Album. This area, and... Roji, not have sentries. I mean, I guess not. They, there's, oh God, he got bashed by Roshan. They go at the same time on Seb. When he tries to get him, go Scepter out. White Album focusing on to one. And it looks like they Seb's will out. eventually kill Soxa here. Most likely White Album. Abatoss down low. They can't get on top of that freaking storm. Soxa down low oh, and Seb will die to the four. They still can't get it. So they have to buy back. They lose no till, but they will kill White Album. Oh, Much dude. needed. But now it's some trouble. Actually, that's get turned on, gets exploded. Sumail, BKB out. Now turning on the land. M, taking him down as well. Monet, angry bear, but the enrage does it up. He's going against them all on his own. And now the rest of the team buys back, gets in the fight, takes down Sumail the boot. Yo, let's Monet go. Monet is the legend, and Borax makes the plays. He, he just followed Seb that whole fight. Like, Seb had gone on, as you know. This Ursa pick was been absolutely superb. And now they're trying to. Heard OG around the map. No tail, didn't get hit with the bugs, can maybe hide away. Oh, X marks the spot again. Borax goes down. That's the play that they needed. They lose Soxa for it though. But can they still take this fight without him? Jumps in, Monet catches on to No Tail. That's Gem on the ground looking for more. They find anybody else looking, jump in. Well, oh, Abyssal Blade turns down into Sumail. Abyssal's one, tries to kill the other, and Sumail falls. Triple kill for Monet. This is the slowest beatdown that we've seen in a while. Doesn't quite manage to find that bash. Oh my god, it was the tether stun. I could not figure out what happened to Sumail. I was like, what? What just interrupted all that? But the shard. It, it's wow. so sneaky the way it operates in this specific scenario because like the way that they're trying to jump in there with Sumail and Seb, right? Like, they're, they're essentially doomed to be in that tether, yeah, right? And true. it's like breaking up. It's such a like finesse combo. You're trying to get like that perfect wobble Radiant situation where they're just like stunned, 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 stunned. Radiant but they, they can't oh, do it. Look at this. Look, yeah. Seb comes in and it's just like, oh, now get you get stunned. Out. Yeah. I mean, look at for everybody that's been around for a while. Normally we talk about like. Io, Storm, and Beastmaster. Still a giant lead, of course, for Aster. You know, you can't get too far ahead of yourselves, but it proves that uh, there is a chance now for OG. They uh, have an opportunity. And you know that's the case whenever there's Morph Shaker. I believe Thompson's fine here. Uh, well, we will see. There, he's thinking oh, about oh, going. Oh, I mean, he knew. Race. So uh, <laughs> He did not know. I don't think. <laughs> he didn't know oh, about did Monet, know. but he didn't, know. Yeah, he didn't yeah, yeah. know about uh, at least the chase down. He the thought Sumail like, could come in. Could, I don't know how it works. I haven't looked yet, but I'm sure you guys will figure it out. An interesting series of events. I, I will say, too, now, you know, you've got the Satanic done for the Morph Lane. They've got a way to dispel there, multiple ways to dispel. Oh, this could be scary. Jump in. Done. No four staff reaction. They can't get there in time. Monet pops the BKB, turns on the Thompson. He's blown up. Has Instant to buy buyback. Back. They know that they need to be here. But again, it's a long roast spawn. Wow, I can't believe all these OG fans are dying when they just lost two heroes. That's so weird. <laughs> like, why, why, why are they cheering? Like, this is not an easy situation. They, they're, they are blind. If you go to their vision, they don't see anything. Yeah. You go to, you go to the vision on Astro, they see everything. They, <laughs> they, see like, OG. they see like the entirety of the middle of this map. Uh-oh. Thompson, he gets jumped on right at the start. The BKBs come out. The beatdown commences. They're just fishing a barrel. Like, that vision's unreal right now. They see everything. But they don't see Sumail. Sumail looking for the chase down, but instead they found Soxa able to chase, able to kill. A double now for Monet. Looking for another. Seeing if he can find a third. And just like that, they take them both down. No buybacks on any of those heroes for OG. They're going to run it. They're trying to force out any type of reaction, any type of buyback. Maybe realizing now that there isn't one. And instead, they're going to set their sights on these Tier 4 towers. Do you go Tier 4s against OG, or do you go for Roche? They're making a decision right now. Will it come back to haunt them? They're dropping down as many of these little... He's over and over again. Oh, Sumail backs away. I think they can end it. They're it's trying 30 to. seconds. They see the speed. They're hitting the buildings. Turns forward. There's the ice blast. It comes down afterwards. Sumail 
dropping somewhat low. Waveform through, doing a good chunk of damage. They have buyback on Building. No Tail, but it's only Sumail that's left. Swings, misses, GG called. Aster, take game number one. Aster, oh man, I bet they're going nuts right now. That's crazy. Get themselves the win versus OG, a team obviously double champion and uh, still a very real threat here at TI, even if they didn't perform that well in the DPC. And they've been showing that in some of their games too. To us, OG yeah. has looked like one of the better teams.